Hello, Stevies. Happy Fury Friday in the garage. Because it's like cold out and stuff. But here's the Honda Fury. We're going to be doing some stuff to it today. I, uh, I do not care for these levers that are on the bike. And Miss Stevie doesn't either. So we're going to switch these levers out. The brake and the clutch lever with these. I bought them on Amazon. They were 23 bucks, I think, something like that. And okay, so I've got the brake lever. They are adjustable. <laughs> yeah, they're 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 23 dollars. Okay, so under here is. I believe this is a 10 millimeter right there and it's got a straight screwdriver head on the top what you need to be careful with though is that you don't break the brake light switch which is what you hear clicking there okay so I'm using a long extension just so I can get away from everything easier that way It was totally undramatic. Yeah. Okay, so simply pull out this way, and there it is. Comes right out. Now, this is going to be the easier side. So then we just simply put this one in. Holding it away from the brake switch. Put the bolt in, and it does need to screw back in. So, we'll get the screwdriver, we'll screw her in. Miss Stevie is gonna come out and help, um, but uh, she's busy with Norwex stuff, so, simply just goes back on the bottom. Tighten it back up. <coughs> there we go. Brake lever installed. And as I said, you flip this. And it moves the lever farther away. Should we do a brake light check quick? We didn't break nothing. Alright, let's uh well, on the clutch side. So this side is just a little bit more difficult. I have actually never done <clears throat> one of these on a metric bike before. But if I understand it right, all we have to do is loosen this up. Oh. Turned it the wrong way, wasn't I? Put down underneath here, and this acorn nut right here. Switch the ratchet over to loosen. Turn this out. Set this somewhere safe. Should be safe there anyway. Okay, so now we have to line up all of these notches. There's a notch there, there's a notch there. Can't see it because it's dark, but there's a notch there also. There we go. Underneath here, magic I guess. You line up that notch there then, and and yeah, it comes right up. So this is the difference between the two. Hopefully we've got enough adjustment because this is a lot, a lot deeper than this. So hopefully we can make this work. I just did that quick off camera. All I did was just line up. All I did was line up the cable with the holes. And then I've got this lined up up here. 
So now, these pins are good and lubed already from the last service that it's had, so I'm not gonna bother putting more lube inside those pins. See, on a Harley, this has just got a, a uh, what the heck do you call it? The pin down at the bottom that's got, it looks like a horseshoe with the two holes in it. Snap ring. A snap ring underneath it, and then that comes right out. Put our nut back on. There we go. And now, if it's like a Harley, which I'm pretty sure it is, you can see that gap right there. We'll just tighten this up until we get that about a quarter inch. I'm gonna say that's good. I'm gonna pull this down, tighten that up, and we should be done. So this clutch lever was like this, and now it looks like that. That is way cooler, especially with the new mirrors. I didn't film putting the new mirrors on because, come on, you've seen that. I guess my only worry is, is that that may not pull the clutch far enough to engage it. That definitely should. I guess we could just start it up and see, huh? great so I mean it doesn't make a huge difference but I, I do like the way that it looks over the way that it did so it is getting colder here like way colder let's address this quick and the thing with that is that we're not gonna be able to ride as much so there are some plans for this bike coming up we're gonna do some changes not nothing drastic Basically, we're just going to change the color of things. There's the, the new mirrors, new levers. So everybody, happy Fury Friday. Everybody stay cool, and we will see you in the next one.